Petra, there's a really frightening man behind you. He looks really serious. That would really freak her out. I can't say things like that in our relationship. <laughs> you want this one? I'm on this one. <laughs> Should I be nervous? You know I have no filter. <laughs> she has no filter. <laughs> I... <laughs> My name's Robin. I'm Petra. Eight, Eight months. months. <laughs> well, we were on the dates at the same time, so we kind of remembered you. <laughs> Hi, Robin. Um, it was June of last year. And we met at Ecstatic Dance, and I just remember him kind of like coming up next to me, and he started dancing, and he was all smiley, and it was really cute. And I was just like, wow, he's shiny. <laughs> Good music. Good choice. Yeah, yeah, totally. Cool. I had no idea what you were saying. Really? But I was enjoying your smiling and laughing. <laughs> I hope that was a good thing. Um, we were at an event called Ecstatic Dance. I was just dancing, doing my thing, and then behind me I see this like, this <laughs> bright, just shiny girl just like skipping around the room. I was like, oh, hey. Um, after the event, we started to chat a little bit, and I could just tell that we, that we were just engaged, that we were just really present with each other. <laughs> it's like literally when she like moves her hands, I like see glitter going. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually really awkward, like, <laughs> and we've never talked about this. I like totally was not ready for it. Totally caught me off guard. And you know how in like Hitch, I think they say you got to be like 50-50 or 80-20 or something like that. And he was like full on like 100%. And I was just like, whoa, <laughs> like, okay. <laughs> and I was just like, all right, I guess he's into me. <laughs> I just felt like I was, we were in the friend zone, like, or in danger of it. So I like, I just, at the end, it's a bit embarrassing now, but I just like leaned in and kissed her. And it was pretty awkward and a bit sort of like stiff. But like, I just, I don't know, I just kind of had to let her know, like, look, um, I don't want to be in the friend zone. And I guess that was my way of expressing that. <laughs> Oh yeah, we haven't really spoken about We've that since. About it. Now's clearly the time that it has to come up, right? Well, first of all, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry that I was clumsy in that moment and maybe couldn't articulate through words that, hey, I think you're nice and I'm gonna be really cool. But hey, I just at least wanted to express to you that I like you. I'm glad we got to talk about that first kiss. Yeah, it's done, it's over. I'm glad you got to explain yourself. <laughs> On camera, great. <laughs> I just remembered like being in bed with him and I was just like, Robin, <laughs> I was like, can I tell you something? And I think he already knew what I was gonna say. And he was just like, do you love me? <laughs> We'd been dating for like a month or so. I think one morning she sort of looked over at me and was like, I um, I kind of, um, and she, she didn't quite go through with saying the words, but I kind of looked over at her and was like, yeah. And now I'm trying to think, did she actually say it? I think one of like the best day ever, we call it, was December 14th of last year, and we went down to San Diego to get his passport because he's Swedish, and we just made like a whole day out of it. We go to Balboa Park, and like we're both imagining like, oh, it's an enormous park, we're gonna picnic and we're gonna play, and it's gonna be amazing. We get there, it's like so much traffic, and there's like not much park. We were just looking for nature, and then we just got lost in a parking lot forever, and he was just like, what is wrong with America? The parks here suck. And it was Christmas, so all the lights were up, and the fountain was doing, like beautiful things and so she brought these penguin Christmas hats so we were both like going around just like as silly penguins and we just had the most incredible day from morning to night and it will forever be known as the best day ever and we will celebrate that day with penguin Christmas hats. When you really tap into your inner penguin, there's mm -hmm. a lot of wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm gonna keep it PG. <laughs> the way that he looks at me. I remember like when I first started hanging out with him and when I would talk to him to my friends, I would just be like, oh my God, his heart, like his heart. It's those eyes that just have so much life in them and so much love and so much beauty and so sultry and so sexy and playful all at the same time. No way. I have sultry eyes. <laughs> she's, she's mentioned my heart a few times and how she feels it. But I think that's what she likes about me. Yes, she did. <laughs> Not only do I find you just so beautiful in every single way, but you're infinitely compassionate with me when I have whatever moments I have or make whatever projections I make or go through my own stuff. But beneath it all, it's just how I feel with you. I just really, really appreciate you. You help me realize a level of self-love that is so much deeper than I've ever experienced. And yeah, um, I know you're going through some challenges sometimes and just don't be so hard on yourself. I really feel like you're the whole package. Thank you for making me be more who I am and who I can be, and for loving me all the way. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just want to say, like, I think we're in, we've rocked this relationship. <laughs>